Luck Voltia. How strong really is this kid? The Lightning Mage of the Black Bulls. First of all, I'm the one Straha. If you enjoy my content, please leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Other than that, let's get right into this video. Play the intro. <laughs> So we know Luck has always been a very good mana sensor and this is because his magic is lightning magic. Now you might be like, okay, what does lightning magic have to do with mana sensory? It actually has to do quite a lot. First of all, lightning magic is derived from wind magic, which is supposedly the best sensor for mana. Um, anyone with wind magic is automatically going to be a, a better sensor than someone without wind magic. And we know after the whole elf thing, when he got possessed by an elf and the elf was using his magic in a very different way, Luck actually took a lot of inspiration from that. Now he puts lightning around his body and he obviously got the boost from the elf. While obviously after losing the elf, he lost a lot of that power, but he retained a lot of the experience the, the elf was using the mana. Dude, does that make sense? I don't really know. It kind of does to me. Now with this whole Heart Kingdom or ordeal, he is now able to use true lightning magic, which is basically lightning magic but from the natural surrounding mana so it's basically real lightning at this point and he's also in the latest chapter able been able to command arrays and if you don't know what an array is an array is basically a type of magic where you could actually command your magic it's, it's kind of weird okay for example let's say i have this lightning magic and the way like luck was using it he was telling his magic to go faster but you could also tell your magic to grow and it will grow you could tell your magic to do a lot of stuff and the more complex obviously the more mana it takes Having lightning magic, it makes Luck one of the fastest Black Bulls characters. Probably the fastest, actually. And his speed is probably unrivaled other than that by light magic users. So lightning is a really good magic because it has properties of almost every um, element. You get the sensory from wind, you get the speed, you get the strength. It just has a lot. It's a very good combative magic. And Luck is just a beast. So if I had to tell you guys how strong I think personally Luck currently is... I do think he's captain level. Honestly, a lot of characters in Black Clover are captain level. A lot of mages are. Does that necessarily mean he could become a captain? I don't know because captain also means you have the experience. You know how to handle and lead a team or a squad. It's not just necessarily all power and strength. And I obviously don't think uh, Luck could go up against Yami. I think Yami's on, on another level. I don't think all the captains are around the same level just as all these squads aren't on the same level. I think Yami, Fuegolion, William even are on a top tier of captains while we have other captains who are on a lower tier. For example, Guldre was probably the lowest tier. <laughs> and ever since this whole Heart Kingdom thing, Luck has become one of my favorite characters. Honestly, I didn't really like Luck that much in the beginning. I just thought, you know, he's the kind of cliche character where he just likes, he loves to fight. But he's actually a deeper character when you look at him. So I, I do, I have started to grow a soft spot for Luck and he's probably one of, like he's getting up there with my favorite characters, honestly. Wait, do you guys know who my favorite character in Black Clover is? Fun fact, I'll tell you right now who it is. It used to be Yuno. When I first got into the series, I really liked Yuno. Um, but now it's Julius Novacrono. I love Julius. I think there's more to him than meets the eye. And he's one of those very interesting characters we don't get to see a lot of. But anytime he's on the screen, I'm always very attentive to what he's saying. And yeah, he's just one of my favorite characters. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed my content. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel as I said in the beginning. Uh, and I'll see you guys next time. Follow me on Twitter if you want. It's literally the one straw hat, no spaces, no capitals, no nothing. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.